to my channel if you are new to my channel hey girl hey so you guys today's video is a little bit different from my channel i wanted to show you guys how i did this diy cut up distress sweatshirt y'all know i'm always wearing something cut up and off the shoulder so i want to show you guys how i do that if y'all like these type of videos let me know and i would definitely do more because i'm always cutting something up all right y'all so here's the sweatshirt that i'm using today it is a super bright orange sweatshirt that i picked up at h&m i believe it was like 14.99 but y'all can always check walmart i'm pretty sure they have even cheaper um sweatshirts there so all you want to do is pretty much make some slits down the arm i didn't take it all the way up to the shoulder area um, I just stopped where the seam started for the shoulders so all you want to do you can cut it down as far as you want to you can make them shorter you can make them longer however you want it Okay, so to make the arms symmetrical, I'm just going to fold the sweatshirt over in half and line the arms up. And then I'm just going to follow the guideline from the right arm and do that exact same thing on the left arm. So if y'all can see this mark right here, that is where I want to start cutting across the back part. So I'm just going to use a highlighter and I'm just going to use this placemat to make some lines. All right, you guys, so now you just want to cut along the lines that you just created, but make sure you are only cutting through that top layer. Do not cut through both layers of the fabric how we did on the sleeves. You don't want to do that. You just want to do the back layer, which would be the top layer right now. Okay, so after you're done cutting, just go ahead and start stretching the fabric. Stretch it as far as you can so it'll be like hanging down. And I also did that on my sleeves as well. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and flip my sweatshirt back over to cut the neck part off. So as you guys can see, I'm going to cut through top and bottom layer right here just to get it started. And then I'm going to lift up the front layer, the top layer of the collar and cut around that you do not want to cut through both layers to do this because it will be hanging off of both of your shoulders instead of one and then you guys can see what i'm probably saying better than i can say it to you guys because the collar is not in the same exact spot in the front and the back so y'all can see that right there and then i'm just going to stretch it out that's pretty much it you guys and y'all see the final look i hope y'all enjoyed this video let me know down below Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter and I'll catch you on my next video.